Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Graven. I'm back with more reactions with an X. Super happy to bring you another episode of Arcane from League of Legends and Riot Games. As you guys know, we started off this series a little bit hesitantly. I wasn't necessarily the biggest fan on the first episode, but every single episode basically has gotten better and better, and that is the sign of a good show, is that not that it doesn't have mistakes, but that it's always getting better. And I think that's, well, you know, always getting better but it's always moving forward progressing developing right i think one of the best parts for me was when the reveal of the underground being juan that was a huge story reveal great like stuff and once again an issue that wouldn't have been there if i didn't already know about league it's one of those preconception things right where like knowing about it made me question it and then but basically every episode has gotten better and better and while i still hate uh, jinx with a passion in my heart the show itself is very good i love the uh the writings and everything going on there were a couple things once again where i was like eh but i think that's with every show i don't think there's ever been a single show that i haven't like nitpicked something and been like me did that wrong me 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 and been a little bitch about it but i'm trying not to i'm trying to enjoy it and i really have been uh i read in the comments from someone and i'm sorry i don't remember the name off top of my head my apologies but who were letting me know that they released this in episodes of three so you're really supposed to watch them in threes right which i wish i had three hours to sit down and just binge them but we do these weekly and i only have so much time every week so i'm trying to get as much done as i can uh, but this is episode six when these walls come tumbling down i do believe that since this is in the three right this is the third of the one, the second part, right? You guys get what I'm saying, right? If it's split into three parts, this is the end of the second part being number six. God, I hate being specific. But it's probably going to be a fire-ass episode. So I'm super excited. If you enjoy watching, you know, come and check us out live. We do watch these most of the time on Twitch. We missed this last week, unfortunately. Our first week in for the new year. Actually, I think it was the second week in. Um, but... We will make it up to you guys. We're going to do some stuff this next week. We have some patron exclusive stuff for everybody. And we are uh, going to have fun and do a new series because we just finished Tack Top Destiny today. So uh, if you guys want to vote on that, you can check out our Discord. It's linked below. If not, that's totally cool. I don't want to talk anymore. We already spent two and a half minutes. And I don't know about you, but I hate talking that much. I feel like it, this isn't about me. It's about the show. So let's check it out. Boom. I'm still not a fan of that. It was a, I think it was a cool concept that didn't fully flesh out. You know what I mean for me? It was the, oh, that's cool. You see the water effect of dirty water or whatever's going there? That's dope. And then it's the mix again. See how in the back it's not quite as high quality as it would just was? But that is cool that the dirty, right, water, and then it r runs out down here. Is this Silco or somebody? <clears throat> Who is this? Oh no, it's Victor. You can tell it's Kane. He's had it since a young age, and he's must be from the lanes because he's just like working on stuff, and uh, he's down low. I mean, it's visually representative. It's really nice. Sky. I'm trying to remember a character named Sky, but I don't remember one from the regular league, you know, stuff. It does well. Oh, what's going on here? Crystals. That is such a cool little thing, though. Look how he made it. That is dope. Silco? Oh, what the fuck? No, that actually looks like the doctor. Don't be afraid. You built this. That looked like the doctor that Silco maybe had been. Yes, it was him. It is him. I was right. The doctor that was with Silco before, back in the past. I don't know where he's been since that explosion. Loneliness is often the byproduct of a gifted mind. Oh. What is it, Tim Chase? We really should. change what fate has in store for us, but we don't have to face it alone. That is probably the best, most intelligent thing she said the entire series, and I, that's that's like throw pillow quotable, bro. Good fucking writing. That's excellent. That is actually a beautiful painting. Oh no. So he's gone back to the, the land of his youth. No wait. He's trying to figure it out. It's 
So there's his Hextech core, which is great. Huh? Huh? Is this his dad? Some shit? No, no, Vi's coming to beat somebody's ass in the bar. That'd be my guess. Or maybe Jinx. Yeah, there, you, there she is. She's very Harley Quinnish. My name's Theorem. Theorem, nice interesting. Chuck. Okay, his name's Chuck. I feel like she's very What's heavily based on her character on Harley Quinn. Grab someone up. <laughs> someone? I don't know what you were expecting. Silco's goons aren't far behind. She, she, she get, and when I say that, she should, she could have won the fight. That wasn't the pressure. She got stabbed because she let up when she was surprised by what, what's her name was saying. I don't know, Savika. Just help me to the edge. To the pits, boys. Can you do this? Guess so. Even injured. Ooh, she can do this. Oh, maybe not. Is this her old hide spot? Oh, damn. How's she alive though? Definitely would have some bruises. Oh, hey, is that uh, Jinx? No, it's one of the uh, fireflies or whatever. Oh, they're after. Right, they own the underground, so it makes sense. Right, if you're gonna be a piece of shit, be a better piece of shit cop. This is what I hate is the piece of shit cops get so cocky in their own spot that then they end up here. With their families in trouble now because of their own stupidity. Oh no. Oops. Oh, so sorry. Accidents happen. He's pretty and the thing is we know he's going to do it there, right? Like he's already tried to kill Vander's kids, right? There's no reason he wouldn't try to kill that guy's real villain though, I like him. Damn, look at him go. It responds to organic rejecting the transmutation. Hmm. You need something to bond it. Something metal. He needs to be component in. There may not be time. We're in uncharted waters here, and I can feel my body eroding. See, is it wrong? I care more oh, about Victor than Vi or Powder. The <laughs> in the meantime. We'll do what we do best. There you go. Push in for your homie, man. Oh. She all fucked up. I will have it destroyed one way or another. Ooh, I don't think so. Opinion. We'll see if the council agrees. Yeah, and he's been playing the game, so he does have power in the council, whereas usually this would have been a par opportunity. I Was that thing's horn injured from them or something else? Yeah, that was the same question. Well, she didn't die. Yet. They really do need to get her medical. She did take a pretty big stabbing. Is she all right? Who the Wait, wait, wait. Easy, easy. That, that, that's, that's, that's Vi, right? Who is that? The gun? Really? That's way more valuable than whatever she just gave you. No, maybe not. That thing looks purple and crazy. All right, maybe I'm bullshitting. Thank you. Then again, it's not always about value. It's a, sometimes about. Oh no, go. he's gonna try to take it. To see a face. No, no, you, 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 he's you not a friend, ahead. is he? He is one of the people. when I was still. Anyway, I, I, I don't want her to. to Who was he? Like this. Just, just tell her. Uh, tell her I'm sorry about everything. He must have been one of the patrons <laughs> of the bar. Nice animation, by the way, on the 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 frog, the the things they were bouncy and crud. Everything's been good, actually. This one, I haven't been to too many parts where I had to like I pick out stuff. The firelights. It matches fragments we found outside your lab and at the hex gates. I believe it's time we gave the beloved founder of our city Ooh a well-deserved retirement. Ooh -hoo 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 you pulled it, man. You started this. This is all a result of your actions, not his. And they all basically have to, because now he has dirt on all of them, too. It has to be unanimous. All in favor. He's not asking. Everybody basically is under his thumb here. With my <laughs> deepest respect and appreciation, Professor. Mm -hmm. 
And damn! Damn! See, I feel like it works better with the shimmer area there. And in short bursts. I think, like, that short burst of... Wait, are they a romance couple? I didn't think about that. What was the name Speaker gave you? Jinx. Nice. Damn. He does talk too much. Also, they came with no weapons and just his monstered out goons. Poor plan. Damn. Nice. Good. <laughs> He better not die there, I, though, I swear. So he beat them to death because they got killed? Cool. I guess that's your dumbass fault once again. Should have brought better... Once again, he had three guys? He didn't even have more people. He had, like, four people, maybe. It was, it's a terrible. And then they have barricades set to check everybody coming across now, so... Now nobody comes across into the city without getting... Mm. Ooh, and the lights, and the... Woo, all right. He really pulled up hard on that, huh? He was like, hey. Oh, no, the mutation. That's why it must live. Is it what produces shimmer? Is that how he made Shimmer, I'm guessing? I don't know. I thought we were going to get more there. Oh, hey, hello there. Yep, that must be it. The, the source of Shimmer seems to be whatever that is. Is that going to be barren one day? I understand now. He's a lot. Oh, is that singed? Is that singed? I actually like this. That that's better for me. Oh no, it's Echo. It, it's got to be right with the board. Come on, it's got to be Echo, one of these kids. I can't believe the fireflies came in at this moment and they're back to back this is dope this is well written honestly i was afraid they were gonna make it so easy and this but she's crazy it shouldn't be that easy when they're you know she's crazy oh don't blow that up you guys will all be in trouble nice see this that is way better. I think this is the Jinx I've wanted them to display. This is not a Jinx who's using overpowering force or even her, right, her minigun of br 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 br. No, it's like this Jinx has to use her traps. This Jinx uses the gun. This Jinx will switch. I'm, she needs to also switch to the rocket launcher at some point, but I'm guessing that's later. Interesting. I was not expecting, very much so not expecting much of this. A vast majority of this was very unexpected and well done. No! All right, I didn't know what they were going to do. I will, I won't lie, it wasn't as hype as I thought it was going to be, but I don't think it mattered. Interesting. I was not expecting, very much so not expecting much of this. The vast majority of this was very unexpected and well done. No! All right, I didn't know what they were gonna do. I will, I won't lie, it wasn't as hype as I thought it was gonna be, but I don't think it matters. You know what I'm saying? 
I think that they it was well done in so many ways, but also that it's it's moving more in line of the natural progression of how I felt it should have been, right? Like, all right, so one of the best examples is Jinx, right? Jinx is crazy! And that needed to reflect better, and it did in this episode, where it's like, yes, even more so than her just losing it during combat, combat and having PTSD, she is actually just insane, right? And there's no problem turning on Silco. That makes all of her decisions from before so much better for me. The truth to the lie stuff of switching over from her family, right? A, a lot of it, I felt, was wrapped up and and better in this, right? Where earlier episodes where I had problems were made better, similar to the Zwan thing. And honestly, I think good shows are written like that, where you have questions, right? Where you're like, meh, what's going on here? Now, you don't want to, to have certain, there's still things, right, where like, uh, like certain little things of like, all right, uh, is that realistic ish? And of course, you gotta lack a daisically do that because we're in a fantasy realm, right? Slash fiction. So obviously, there's magic, and you don't necessarily actually have to have a reason for anything. You could always just say magic, and that would be good because that's how fantasy works. It just does. A fiction, not. But fantasy, yes, and this is fantasy, so you could do a lot. But there are things where you establish these, you know, things where it's like, well, how can they do this without doing that? Or how can they do that without doing this? For example, the, um, I wouldn't have accepted the Silco to his house thing, to the Marcus's house thing as much, had they not already kind of pre-set up their interactions before and lent the idea to this kind of like relationship being a long established one that does things right that's not just oh uh i came into your house and it's like because then it's like well wait that's that would beget a violent response right or this because of that but no he knows silco so he knows he'll do what he says he knows he has the ability to do what he says and they've they've done enough business that there is some vested interest in marcus to not turn him in for whatever this reason or that even beyond his daughter right but we're just gonna have to see there's three more episodes so we'll be doing this till about the end of january i believe and uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying it as always if you want to check us out we do these live every week on sundays you can check us out on twitch at twitch.tv slash reactions with an x there will be a link below where you can go check that out in our description you can also talk to us on discord any day where we like to talk about all the different series we're watching we uh we release a bunch of other stuff on there and if you really want to see these without all the cuts we have to do on youtube later you can check them out on patreon for as low as a dollar a month as well as a bunch of other series that are uh, early access or exclusive right because we release these ahead of time on patreon compared to when we release them on youtube but i don't want to take too much of your time i do want to say that like i said before this gets better and better every episode this episode was a bit of a meander it wasn't necessarily that much better than the episode before it in my opinion but there was a lot of build and different stuff in it and a lot of like peeks into people that i thought was really cool there were still some questions like i can't remember who the guy was uh with the the throbby forehead i'm sure he was in one of the first episodes but it's been like a month since i saw that so that's kind of hard to remember and, you know, I don't really have much more to say, but thank you for watching. Uh, you know, I really do appreciate every single view, every single person who chats, and every single comment to inform me what's going on in the show. And we'll catch you next time on Reactions with an X, Arcane. I hope you guys have a great one.